Hello and welcome to this podcast episode about the year 1909. This year was a significant time in history, with many important events and milestones taking place around the world. Let's start with some of the major news stories of 1909. In January, explorer Ernest Shackleton and his team reached the furthest point south on their expedition to Antarctica. This was a remarkable achievement, and it helped to establish Shackleton as one of the greatest explorers of his time. In February, the Hudson Motor Car Company was founded in Detroit, Michigan. The company would go on to become one of the most successful automobile manufacturers of the early 20th century, producing a wide range of cars and trucks that were popular with consumers around the world. In March, the National Association for the Advancement of Colored People, NIOXMA, was founded in the United States. This organization was dedicated to promoting equal rights for African Americans and fighting against racism and discrimination in all forms. The NIAC cap would go on to play a pivotal role in the civil rights movement in the decades to come. In April, the first Woolworth store was opened in New York City. This was the first five and dime store in the United States and it quickly became a popular destination for shoppers looking for affordable goods. In June, the first cross-country automobile race was held in the United States. The race covered a distance of 3,400 miles from New York City to Seattle, Washington, and it was won by George Suster driving a Thomas Flyer car. In July, French aviator Louis Blériot became the first person to fly across the English Channel. Blériot piloted his own aircraft, a monoplane from Calais in France to Dover in England, covering a distance of 22 miles in just over 36 minutes. In October, the Imperial Russian Army took over the city of Tiflis, now known as Tbilisi, in Georgia. This event, known as the Tiflis Bank Robbery, was a violent clash between Russian revolutionaries and the Russian authorities. The robbery and subsequent uprising were significant events in the lead up to the Russian Revolution of 1917. In the world of sports, 1909 was a significant year as well. The Pittsburgh Pirates won the World Series, defeating the Detroit Tigers in seven games. This was the Pirates' first championship since 1903, and it was a major accomplishment for the team and its fans. In the world of literature, 1909 saw the publication of several important works. These included Howard's Inn by E.M. Forrester, The Machine Stops by E.M. Forrester, and The Secret Garden by Francis Hodgson Burnett. These books are now considered classics of 20th century literature and have been enjoyed by generations of readers. In the world of science, 1909 was a significant year as well. American physicist Robert Millikan measured the charge of an electron for the first time using an experiment known as the oil drop experiment. This breakthrough helped to confirm the existence of electrons and paved the way for many important advances in physics and electronics. In conclusion, the year 1909 was a time of great change and progress in many areas of human endeavor. From the founding of the NIAC P to the first cross-country automobile race. From Louis Blériot's historic flight across the English Channel to the publication of classic works of literature, this year was full of important events and developments that helped to shape the world we live in today. Thank you for listening to this podcast, and we hope you have enjoyed learning about the year 1909.